Hey guys, welcome back to Black Room Gaming. I'm your host Creepy Soul, and today we have a JRPG News Tokyo Special. This is basically just a special um, from Tokyo Game Show. They've announced a ton of JRPGs, so let's get caught up. First up, we have Dragon Quest Heroes, which has just been announced for the PlayStation 4, which is going to be released in September 2015. Next we have Persona 5 coming to the PlayStation 4. So we all know that Persona 5 was uh, announced this year for the PlayStation 3. Now they're announcing it for PlayStation 4. Um, and that's due out in 2015 as well. Next is Fairy Fencer F Avent Dark Force which has also been announced for the PlayStation 4. There, it seems like there's been a slew of PlayStation 4 announcements, which is really, really great to see because Japan needs to hop on board with the PlayStation 4. It hasn't really sold well um, in Japan, so hopefully with these releases, it will get a lot more sales and we can get a lot more JRPGs on PlayStation 4. Um, so that's going to be due out in, in 2015 as well. Um, I don't have any trailers yet. Um, if I have any images, I'll pop them in the video as well. Next is Sky 5, which has been announced for the PlayStation 4 as well. So, as we all know, Nipponichi Software, the Sky Games, Strategy JRPG, if you've never played one, look them up, give them a try. They're awesome games. Um, so that's going to be released next year in Japan. Um, hopefully we'll get a release next year, cross our fingers. Um, also have a uh, link in the description below, below for a trailer as well. Next is Dan Gan Roper, another episode. I'll just pop I'll pop the latest trailer in the description below. It's basically just announcing it's going to be due out in Japan September 25. PS Vita, as we all know, it's gonna be an action shooter spin-off. Check out the trailer. Last but not least is Eyes, which is an action RPG. Um, known in the JRPG world for a very long time. It's kind of a classic. Um, they've announced a new game in the series that's going to be released for the PlayStation 4 and PlayStation Vita, set in the Gaia Sea, and that's it. Thanks for tuning in for the uh, Tokyo Game Show JRPG News Special. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I'm your host, Creepy Soul, and I'll catch you guys next time.